What would Freisinger want with a lowly officer on the Eastern Front? What does it matter? It matters a great deal to me, Fraulein. Nice lighter. From what I could gather, Freisinger was recruiting Steiner for some special project. Project Phoenix. Could be. All I know is... I was sent to kill Freisinger. There's got to be a better way out of here. There is no way out of here. Unless, of course, you have decided to do the intelligent thing. Open that door back up, and I'll show you the intelligent thing. You can get me out alive? What? I can. <laughs> you two-faced bastard. All right. I'll tell you what you want to know. Typical Aussie. No honor, no loyalty. Raise this up. I can't. I ain't gonna be the next sacrifice in your crusade, Tommy. I hope your plan was worth it. Break a leg, Lucas. I thought you'd be the one to put an end to your team's foolish agenda. You killing each other now, are you? Zuluk! Zuluk! to cooperate. I would not take orders from a Negro either. <laughs> you got it all wrong, mate. Now don't follow. I don't care what color his skin is. Haven't you heard about the Aussies and the Brits? We were the pieces of shit flushed down the crown's dunny. Yes, yes, of course, but your nations are allies. It was more like master servant. I did what I did because to every Brit, folks like me are expendable. Insubordinate, churlish, no stranger to a prison cell. That's Lucas. You had to credit the SOE. They were very good at spotting talent in the unlikeliest of places. And Lucas had talent. He was a skilled demolitionist with an explosive temperament and a sharp tongue. Out there in the desert, the rats of Tobruk were like a family. Unfortunately, they never did figure out how to get along with the brass. Today, princess. I'm savoring the moment. Oh, I'm so sorry. Of course you are, Your Highness. Hey, Bluey, wake up. You're going to want to see this one. Oh, fuck me. Play the damn cards. <laughs> All right, Des. Read them and weep. Oh, you fucking donkey. No way. Why the bloody hell aren't you at your post? Uh, Major Hems, we thought... You thought you'd muck around. Major, convoy's approaching. Right. You rats, follow me. 
try and act like real soldiers for once. Sir. Oh, yes, sir. No, sir. Three. See, that's what a real soldier looks like, mate. <laughs> ah, what a way to stand up to him, Bluey. Good job, buddy. Fuck off, Des. What's he even doing here in the first place, huh? If he's a major. He can do whatever he wants. You're lucky. I was about to make me come back. Shut up, Des. You've never beat me at anything. What? Oh, mate, pull the other one. Explosives are ready. Lucas and I set them ourselves. Sir? Man your position. The timing must be perfect. I need you all to focus. You got eyes on them? I will have to call the pad. Hang on now. What's that in the lead? I say, be quiet. Ah, ah, ah. I'll do the honors. Thank you, Cap. Sir. Mark is that first rock. Yes, I know. That's a tank. Well, Germans have tanks, Private. No, but the armor's too thick. We didn't pack for a tank. Bloody hell. Hit the treads. It's the only way you're going to stop it. I, I, I need to focus. No, no, sir, wait for the treads. No, no, wait! You distracted me. Lucas. Bet you could throw a banger into that tank's hatch. Raid and half the supplies we wanted have gone up in smoke. Sir, there's still one truck down the ridge. Well, then take some rats and get after them, Jacob. Let's go. No good for sniffing around the dirt. And when you're done, walk your asses back to camp. Are you serious? That'll take all fucking night. Let's go, Private. Told you they didn't get far. Watch out, one's still alive. We can fix that. Good night, Kraut. I thought there were more. One dead in the truck. Other wanker must have run off. Then we find it. Yeah, that's more rifle than you can handle. Bigger the better, mate.
fresh blood. Follow it. Fucking genius idea, Jacobs. That's sir to you, Private. The name's Des. And that's Lucas. And neither of us give a fuck about your rank. We all know about you, Jacobs. Us rats pay attention more than you think. Quiet. Do you hear that? Who's he shouting to? This way. We could take him. Are you mad? You got me and Lucas. Sie kommen in unsere Richtung. Then we're leaving. Hey, I found something. You read Crow? A little. Of course he does. It looks like one of Rommel's officers checked through here to visit a camp up the way. I don't know what kind, I don't recognize these symbols. And we go take a look. The Krauts just lit up the sky. More could be coming. No, we return to base. Report to the Major. We can't report a thing if we don't know what it is. That wouldn't be good soldiering, Jacobs. Fine. We'll scope it out. Let's tread quietly this time. This road should take us directly to the camp. Straight into those cracks. Get off the road before they see us.
You sure you're going the right way? I'm going the only way, you dickhead. That's enough, Des. This isn't a joke. I need a drink. Talk with your man, Hans. He's got plenty. What? He's never shared a sip from his fancy flask? Uh, well, there should be plenty to go around. He's a bloody lightweight. If I ever get my hands on that wanker's flask, <clears throat> it's my shout, fellas. Hang on. There's a light up ahead. Looks like we found the German camp. Where is everybody? Probably out looking for us, I reckon. <laughs> Hold on, what's all this? Who cares? Look at this. I think the chap on the left is wrong. Who's the fancy bugger? Seriously? We're gathering intelligence. Something you obviously lack, Private. Hilarious. You sort your papers. You know what I see? I see a ton of shit outside that goes boom. Now, what do you suppose we should do about that? Uh, well, we should blow it the fuck up. <laughs> That's what I call target rich. Motor pool on the left. Ammo dump just ahead. Gas depot on the right, just asking to be lit up.
That was glorious, Lucas! Oh! I can't believe it! Stick with the rats, Jacobs. You might learn a thing or two. Wait. You guys hear that? for us.
On the coast of Italian Libya, an Australian private and a group of rats had given Rommel a huge black eye. Their action should have earned them medals, and maybe even a shred of respect. Pams didn't see it that way. Their reward was some time in the brig. However, all Richter seemed to care about was Rommel and his connection to Freisinger. That fool would listen to Lucas as long as we needed him to. the rest? We have very little time. Tell me, what did Freisinger want with Rommel? I thought you wanted to know about our team. Answer me now or our deal is off. Okay, okay. Don't get your undies in a twist. Lucas piled it on like a chap. He didn't have to tell Richter anything more than the lies that Nazi already told himself. That was the Third Reich for you. Their reality was delusion.